I just wanted to say hello, everybody. Hi. And it's sounding great. Thank you very much. And I uh, hope you're having fun with it. If you're not, you better get having fun with it. <laughs> Peter said to me, would you ever consider, that was kind of the, the start of it for me, would you ever consider writing something for ballet? And I basically said yes. <laughs> well, the story was yours, all yours. But I had some suggestions. Absolutely, yeah. So then they started the collaboration. Well, you see, what I've found out since is that you don't have to have a story in a ballet. I mean, more modern ballets might just be abstract. But that wouldn't be the evening that I would most like to go to. Not being a major expert uh, as far as dance is concerned and not knowing the nuances. to say that it's Little Mermaid meets Romeo and Juliet in a way, even though I'm not a mermaid. I'm not a creature. I'm just a princess. Choreography is by Peter Martins. He obviously had a game plan before he came in, but you don't really know what you want to do until you really get in there. And what works on me and what doesn't, what works on Robbie, and how we react. So it was a very hands-on, in the moment, process. I am very excited that Paul is coming, but I'm also a little bit nervous because if there's things he doesn't like, there is not much time to change. Ladies and gentlemen, can I introduce you to Sir Paul McCartney? He's just very, very involved. He asks if there's something in the music that we think we'll want slower or faster, and he asks if that's okay. He choreographed this one part in the circus scene, and everybody just started laughing because it was actually really, really good. It's just nice to have someone that's there and wants to be there. But I might say just sometimes, if I'm thinking of an idea with the music, I'll say, this is where she turns and she stops the advancing army. And she, and Peter will go, I like Whoa. that. <laughs> you said, you said like to me, Whoa, you are a dancer. <laughs> I'm going, well, yeah. maybe just a little. Stella McCartney is Paul McCartney's daughter, and she's the costume designer for the ballet. In the ocean world, all the women have gowns on. And she did the Terra Punks. She did these amazing tattooed unitards. They're being dyed to everybody's skin color, and then they look like they have tattoos all over their body. When we were talking about the staging, we just thought we would make it look underwatery. The first thing that comes to mind is that uh, initially everything should be sort of slow motion. Mm. But you can't be slow motion all the time. So you sort of suggest in the beginning that it's underwater, and then I think you have to sort of let it go. I do love telling a story, and for this, it's a brand new character. I'm still trying to figure out what she would do, how she would feel here. You have to know the story in your head and be that feeling in your face, in your body language, you can't fake it. That's amazing for me to be able to experience that 